Dawson's Burrowing Bees. Their Yingara name is Mugudgura or Jiribari. Because I was born and bred in Carnarvon, when I was growing up, I used to ride horses out to the beach and like this time of the year, we could hear this buzzing for miles and we knew they were bees, but we didn't know what sort of bees they were. So we used to just ride around them. So totally See, the white ones are the females and brown ones are the males. So they're, the, they're also one of the biggest bees in the world. They don't produce honey. They lay a grub in their burrows, just like a body grub, which is a delicacy to the Aboriginal people. So after mating season, you know, a few, well, maybe three, four months after that, they go and dig them up, dig the burrows up and put the burrows in the coals and eat the grub. All the females are in the burrows. So the ones that are flying around would have mated already. Because yep. they only mate once and that's it. Yep. The males don't bother with them. But the ones in the burrows haven't been mated because they don't produce honey, they get, they do get their honey from the bluebell and the poverty bush, but the honey goes into the burrows to feed the, the grub. Mm -hmm.